Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to discuss about plasma. Okay. So, what is plasma? Okay. So, plasma is the fourth state of matter. Okay. So, now you see, suppose we have a solid here. Okay. So, these are the particles. Okay. In solid state, the particles are very closed. Okay. And they can vibrate about its mean position okay now when you apply heat when you apply heat okay when you supply heat its temperature increases as its temperature increases the space between the particles increases and it it becomes liquid then again if you continue supply heat then it will become gas okay so in this two in these two states uh, liquid and gas the molecules or atoms that means the particles of this matter can freely move okay so but what is the fourth state what is the plasma actually so how it is differ from these three states so in these three states solid liquid and gases these particles are neutral okay these particles are neutral if they are atom then the electrons electrons the electrons negatively charged electrons are orbiting around the positively charged nucleus okay these electrons are not free in these three states okay but when when a substance in the gaseous states which is uh, whose particles are neutral then if you supply heat here also and it, and if you continue supplying heat then we will obtain a stage where the gas molecules will be ionized and here electrons will be free they can freely move and they are no longer orbiting around the nucleus okay and this state is plasma and to be a plasma to be a plasma it must satisfy these two conditions quasi neutral and collective behavior and we are going to discuss in details these two be uh, these two properties okay before that let me give you two examples so the sun and lighting these are examples of plasma okay so they are in plasma states okay there are many examples okay so let us discuss about now quasi neutral and collective behavior so what do you mean by quasi neutral now you see suppose we have a gas here okay so and these are the gas particles so now you see when a substance uh, is in gaseous state so all the particles are neutral all the gas molecules are neutral okay so now you see in this case electrons electrons are orbiting around the nucleus okay then it becomes plasma when the gas uh, or the gas uh, gas particles are ionized okay when you supply heat or energy in any other form okay then the gas molecule gets ionized and the electrons are now free they are no longer orbiting around the nucleus okay they can now freely move okay so now you see though the electrons and uh, though the uh, though this state of matter this is plasma state the or the uh, you or you can say fourth state of matter uh, consists of positive and negative charged particles here the number of positively charged and number of negatively charged particles are equal in numbers okay so positive and negative charge are equal though it consists charged particles as a whole it is neutral so that is what quasi neutral means okay so hope you have understood this what is quasi neutral okay so now let us discuss about collective behavior 
So what is collective behavior? Suppose any substance in the plasma state, it has positively charged and negatively charged ions. Okay, positively charged ions and negatively charged electrons. Okay, and here electrons can freely move. They are no, no longer orbiting around the nucleus. Okay, so now you see when this such part uh, charged particles moves. Okay, suppose this positively charged particles is moving in this direction okay then it will repel this positive charged okay so it it will repel any positive charged close to it okay and it will attract the negatively charged electrons negatively charged electrons towards it okay so here you see so let me show you here this is one positively charged ion this is another positively charged ion there is an electron suppose this is negatively charged electrons when there is another suppose positively charged ions and there is also negatively charged electrons when it is moving towards them it will repel these two positively charged and it will attract the negatively charged electrons okay and due to this motion of the electrons okay due to the motion of this uh, charged particles not only the electron charged particles an electric field will be generated electric field will be generated and also an electric current will be generated electric current due to the motion of charge okay because these electrons are moving in this direction okay and the positive charge is moving in this direction okay which represents the direction of current okay so now you see electrons are millions time lighter than these uh, positively charged ions so they can move faster than these positively charged ions okay so this is the interaction of only one region only this region i have shown here okay but this interaction will influence all other all other positively and negatively charged ions okay it will influence the motion of it will affect the motion of all other particles not only in this region it will affect the remote area as well okay this behavior this behavior is called collective behavior and as there is uh, electric current as electric current is generated so we will have a magnetic field as well okay it gives rise to a magnetic field also okay so this is called collective behavior so we can define plasma as a plasma is a quasi neutral gas which exhibits collective behavior collective behavior So that's how we can define uh, plasma. Okay, what is plasma? So hope you have understood this. What is plasma? Okay, in the next video we are going to discuss about uh, dual shielding. Okay.